Can you imagine being caught in a debt you just can't seem to get out of? The interest on it compounds and it increases and it seems hopeless. And then one day in the mail you open your statement and it says paid in full. Imagine the relief, the joy, the gratitude. And that's what we are being invited to as we enter Holy Week now and remember what Jesus Christ has done for us. He has paid the debt to God that we could never pay, the debt for our sins. Even though our sins may not be serious, they are sins. They are disobedience to the Father. And the perfectly obedient one in our place offers that obedience to the Father that we could never give and by that has redeemed us, has saved us. So in turn, what can we give? Only our promise to be thoughtful and to remember what Jesus has done for us, the great price he paid for our redemption, giving his life on the cross, and in remembering to give thanks. So let us commit ourselves to join together as a community of faith in this most holy week that lies before us to do just that.